Hi ladies, I am here with you. I just got a new tripod. So this is sort of a tester video um, to see if my tripod is going to be okay with the camera focus on my new phone. So I um, wanted to share a project share. I am hosting a swap over on craft swapping sisterhood group on facebook i'm an admin over there and i posted a swap that was um made to make three or make four envelopes three by out of six by six paper so they're like three by fives or three by three envelopes so i made these out of six by six paper and the swap is you decorate one and send three for your partner to decorate and you include ephemera and items for them to decorate their envelopes that you send so then I watched Anna Powell's video, and she is also over in my group and joined the swap. And in her video, she made this cool little stacked envelope. I believe she got the idea from Miss Everly, which I will post her link below. And in it's so it's all about envelopes, which I am really into. I like envelopes. So I'm going to partner with Anna Powell because she went a little bit above and beyond because the swap was really only supposed to be four of these, but she made the stacked thing. So I'm going to partner with her and send her my stacked envelope for the swap as well. So anyway, she doesn't know yet that we <laughs> that I'm her partner and so by the time this video gets posted is being pre-recorded she will have already received this swap and I will have gotten the one that she made on her video so I basically just went and used my envelope punch board and I just picked random sizes so on my envelope punch board I believe I did the biggest one is like a ten and a half by ten and a half sheet of paper. And then I went with a nine by nine. And then I did a seven and seven eighths one. And then I did a six by six. So I just kind of graduated in sizes so that I could get different sizes. And I used this paper that I got at... Hobby Lobby. It was called the Watercolor Girls. I believe I've shown this already from a different video. So I just got that and decided that I would use it um, in this video. So after I made the videos, I just kind of placed them on there, making sure that I could open each one. And then I just glued them to the back to the flap so this one's glued to the flap this one's glued to the flap and this one's glued to the flap and then I just filled them so each of these don't have any velcro or anything on them except for this first one and in here I added some gems from the um, kit the paper kit and I punched out some of these tabs that are also in that one. And then in this one, it came with a bunch of different ephemera pieces, which I added. Some of the ephemera pieces are added here, and I stuck those in there. I am going to die cut some words to go in there for her as well. And then on this one, I didn't want to glue anything more because it was already getting kind of bulky to the envelope itself so I just made a paper clip here with pieces from the paper pack the polka dot paper the flower paper is the same as this envelope and then I just added some flowers I picked up at Hobby Lobby and this piece in the back that says adventure waits is 
a sticker from the ephemera pack and then I added a little tassel. I just die cut the card and clipped it to the card and then I'm just simply going to slide the card into the envelope and leave that as the decoration for this one. And then inside I added some of the girls and also added one of my Memordex cards with my info on the back that I made using this paper line as well for my partner to have if she wants to create her own Memordex she is welcome to do that and then on the very last one which I'll show here in a second sorry A little fiddly because it's not actually attached and then this very last one I decorated the envelope up some my own style and then this is the actual swap so in this envelope there is four um, policy envelopes made with six by six paper and then the one I decorated is this one so I used the girl from the ephemera pack a piece of the word ephemera the camera ephemera and then I just added some paper Hobby Lobby flowers it's very simply decorated but I think it turned out really cute anyways and so that is what the actual swap is supposed to be <laughs> And I will put this right in there for um, Anna Powell. And that is how it's going to be sent. So the only thing I have left to add to this is the die cut. I'm going to die cut some words, hello, and add them into the ephemera envelope here. And then I will wrap it up with a piece of tissue and some probably some sort of twine and send that as my swap. But it turned out really super cute and I really enjoyed making this. I will probably make a few more using this kit and um, some other kits that I have picked up. So anyways, I just wanted to share. Thank you all for stopping by. Please hit that like button and leave me a comment. I absolutely love hearing from you. So you all have a wonderful day and thank you so much.